is taxation theft? Uh, what is taxation? What is theft? Let's look at some of these definitions. We're talking about words is what we're talking about here. So theft is generally described as the taking of somebody else's property without their permission. And so there are a lot of forms that this could, could come in. One would be robbery. And that would usually be if there's somebody right there and they're immediately threatening you. Um, that is a type of theft. Uh, they're threatening bodily harm. Uh, another would be burglary. And we kind of relate that to entering somebody's house and taking something or their car or something to that effect or entering a, a place. And then there's petty theft. And that kind of means smaller theft. Now, these words I'm using have a lot of different uh, ways from which they can be perceived. One of those ways is legal. And what is legal? Well, legal is uh, legal refers to the laws of the land. Whatever land you are in, there are is probably a government that runs the uh, the legal system in your area, and the government writes down rules and they call them laws. And they write them down to most of them are pretty close to. Uh, what makes sense in real real life. Like there'll be a law that says uh, you may not steal from people. Uh, however, what the government does when they write these laws is they add a clause in there, you may not unlawfully steal from people. So it, it's kind of like protecting themselves because if they write it, it's a law. So if they choose to steal and they say it's okay to steal, then that's not really going to fall under their definition of theft. Isn't that convoluted? But that's that's what they do. And if you don't believe me, look online, uh, find a, a Google search petty larceny and then read the words and you'll see there's an exception that the government gives to itself for doing things. And it'll say lawful, usually uh, something to that effect. So there's a legal way of looking at the word theft. And then there is a just kind of common parlance, what uh, what something is, more of a, a, a not a particular legal jurisdiction's definition of the word, but more of a general definition, a dictionary definition. And in that case, yeah, theft is, uh, theft is when you take something away from somebody. Uh, so is taxation theft? Well, yeah, if you take taxes away from somebody uh, and, or you make them pay you, then that is theft. And so what are some of the common arguments against this, this point of view or this reality, I think? Um, I, I've never heard a good argument otherwise. Now, I have heard arguments to the effect of, well, we need to have taxes because we need to help the poor bail out auto companies that are failing or banks or something like that. Or we need to be able to uh, have a military so that we can kill a lot of people in other places. So there are a lot of things that we could argue the merits of whether or not those things need to be done. And if so, should we steal money from each other for it? But we're not looking at that philosophy right now. This is a this is a word conversation. Um, we're talking about the meanings of words. So what arguments would there be that taxation is not theft? Um, basically, let's look at what happens. If somebody says to me, uh, Shepard, if you don't give me 25% uh, of what you've earned this year, hand it over right now, and if you don't give it to me, I'm going to shoot you or I'm going to throw you in a cage and uh, you know, kidnap you and throw you in a cage. If somebody says that to me and they're pointing at a knife right at my throat, then we would say that that's robbery. If, on the other hand, they send a letter to me and say, hey, just so you know, this is what's happened to people uh, who haven't obeyed us when we demand money. Um, we come and kidnap them and we put them in, in buildings. And if they resist us, we shoot them. Uh, or we use the minimum amount of force necessary. But you know, if they, if they defend you, uh, themselves against us when we're trying to steal from them, we'll, we'll kill them. And that's kind of the truth about taxes, isn't it? And if you think taxes are voluntary, and I'm kind of talking about income tax here, uh, no, it's not a voluntary thing. You're required to do it. If you don't, it starts out with some nasty letters. And if you do what you would do if a regular hoodlum sent you those letters, you just ignore them or you write back and say, buzz off, quit, quit annoying me. Uh, then the next step, it'll just kind of step up. Then somebody will come to your house and say, hey, we're serious about this. You need to pay. And then they'll start attaching your bank account or they'll put a lien on your property. And then if you still don't do it, then they'll come and try to take your property because 
you don't pay on it or what, they'll come up with some reason, some, some legal. Again, legal means their laws tell them what they can do and they are going by what they are allowed to do. It's ridiculous. What happens in the long run? You, you, you get hurt. You, you can't get out of it. So taxation is definitely not a voluntary thing. Um, so taxation is theft. And I, I want an argument otherwise. I mean, I would love it if I could say, oh, this kind of makes sense. But it is theft. Now, before you argue with me about this, please think about the words and then tell me. And remember, this is not about is it okay to steal? Is theft okay? We're not talking about a, a, a value judgment of it, whether it's good or bad at this point. This is a word conversation. All we're talking about is, is taxation theft? What do you think? 